Hi, my name is Nelson Rosen and I'm a pediatric colorectal surgeon here at Cincinnati Children's. Today we're going to talk about Hirschsprung's associated enterocolitis. Hirschsprung's disease, children are born with a condition in which the bottom part of the large intestine, also called the colon, doesn't have half of the nerves it needs to work normally. So what that piece of intestine is doing is squeezing all the time and all the intestine upstream is trying to push things through it and it just doesn't work. One of the things that is a little known complication of Hirschsprung's disease that can occur before surgery or after surgery is called enterocolitis. And enterocolitis, I want you to think of that like a GI bug where children can have bloating, pain, vomiting, diarrhea, fever. Enterocolitis is a condition that we treat with antibiotics by mouth, most commonly an antibiotic called metronidazole or trade name Flagyl, and that antibiotic targets the particular bacteria we see in the large intestine. The other primary treatment for enterocolitis is what we call rectal irrigations, where we teach parents how to wash out the bottom part of the intestine and get out the stool, get out the gas, but most importantly, to wash the bacteria from the lining of the intestine to make sure that the environment is clean and it allows the child to feel better, to not be as bloated, and to get well, to be able to drink, eat, and go about their lives. If you think that your child might have enterocolitis or is displaying any of these symptoms, definitely check in with your doctor and make sure that everything is okay. We hope this information was helpful to you. If you'd like more information about our center, please call us at 513-636-3240 or contact us by email, colorectocenter at cchmc.org or like us on Facebook.